And we're here today with Coach Lauren Dawson as we get ready to kick off the 2016 season with the Ruse headed to Conway, Arkansas to take on Hendricks. Now, Coach, this is the second time in the last five years and the first time since 2013, uh, 2013 that the team has opened the year on the road. Mm -hmm. What are some of the additional challenges to opening a season on the road as opposed to at home? Uh, you know, there's some logistic things that you got to plan out, and we, we do a, we spend best time in the summer trying to design a plan that, that's the best within our given parameters of trying to minimize missed class time and budget so that our players can have a quality trip, and we want to do everything we can to uh, make sure they're, they're at their best when Saturday at 1 o'clock gets here. Um, you know, all teams and all sports are always going to have a higher winning percentage at home. There's definitely an advantage to playing at home, but we like being on the road. Uh, we were on the road a lot last year, six games, and you know some of the greatest experiences and memories you have as a player and as a coach are those bus trips to and from. So, yeah, it's out of our control. You got to play some home, some play some away. We do the best we can at both. Now, last season you guys got a big season opening win, uh, win against Hendricks, uh, which started looking better and better as the year went on, and the Warriors wound up winning the SAA. Uh, now they open the year ranked just outside of the top 25. What kind of team are you expecting this weekend? Yeah, I think they'll be one of the best. Uh, teams we play all year. You know, they went to the national playoffs last year. They won their conference. They have every starter back on offense. I think they have 10 of 11 starters back on defense. Uh, both all the specialists back. The running back led Division Three in all-purpose yards, and the quarterback's the top five quarterback in the country. So, I have zero doubts that this will be one of the best teams we play all year, and, and it'll be a great game. Now, obviously, every year there's going to be some roster uh, roster turnover, but you know, you certainly have some big pieces to replace from last year. So how do you go about replacing guys like Madison Ross, Brooks Ward, Brett Vaughn, guys like that? Yeah, I don't think one person is going to replace any of those guys. Those guys were very special players. Um, but at the same time, when those guys started their first game two or three years ago, we knew they were good, but we didn't know they were going to be that good. To get that good takes time and reps on the field. And, um, you know, those are, they're that good because they were multi-year starters. So uh, we'll, we'll team approach, and, and we'll get through it. Okay, now last year, Cooper Woodyard was still kind of transitioning from wide receiver to quarterback. Now he's got a full season as quarterback under his belt, plus the you know spring practice. So what have you seen through, uh, from him through fall camp this year? Uh, first and foremost, he's become an excellent leader. I mean, he is everything you'd want in your quarterback in terms of being a leader of the offense, and he's, he's embraced that, and he's grown in that, and we challenged him in certain areas to become a better leader, and he's responded to all that. Now, in terms of once the ball snapped, obviously he, he's experienced. You're always better at something the second time through. So he's going to be better. The number of things we can do with him has increased um, because we have great confidence in him to make decisions both pre-snap and post-snap to put us in the best position to win. Well, Coach Dawson, good luck this weekend as you head out to Conway, Arkansas. Thank you, Jeff. appreciate you.